In this example, we'll demonstrate how to create associative measurements, which dynamically update as the parts are moved. To begin, click 3D measurement on the 3D measurement toolbar. Also click double measurement. Now, click vertex on the 3D selection toolbar. To measure the distance between the plates, click two points on the model. Now we'll create a second measurement, this time between two edges. On the 3D selection toolbar, click edge. And then click two edges on the model. Because the plates are parallel, the measurement results are the same. Let's move apart to see how associative measurements work. First turn off the measurement toolbar to stop creating measurements. Now we need to select the part that we want to move. On the 3D part transformation toolbar, click transform parts. In the part transformation dialog box, confirm that coordinate system is set to global, and the transform mode is set to translate. Click Z to move the part along the Z axis. And then click and drag the slider to move the top plate away from the bottom plate. As the plate moves, the measurements dynamically update. Now click rotate to change the transform mode. And select the Y axis. Now click and drag the slider to rotate the top plate. The measurement on the left changes to show the angle between the plates. The other measurement updates to show the changing distance. Your 3D model files must contain BREP entity IDs for you to create associative measurements. You can use Inspector to check whether or not they are in your models. Choose Actions. And then choose Inspector. In the Inspector dialog box, click Execute. On the Results tab, in the Details section, expand the node for the first part. Then open JT Content. Geometry and XDB rep. The inspector results confirm that the part contains entity IDs. In this video, you learned how to create measurements which automatically update as the associated parts are moved. You also learned how to use inspector to find out if your model contains B rep entity IDs, which are required for associative measurements.